This episode sees us camping two nights at the Lake Red Brook Holiday Retreat in the Fraser Coast area of Queensland. Imagine how happy we were when Luana, the owner, offered us this prime spot for us to camp. Wedgetail eagles circulating above. All the birds are on high alert. Flown away now, so they're all coming back. Richard's going on a walk here at the Lake Red Brook Retreat. It's about a one kilometre return walk, and he should be seeing some birds. Okay, Richard's back from his walk. What did you find out? Well, I just did a short walk, which was about a kilometre. We're actually slashing up in the top field for future off grid caravans. And because of the rubbish that it's, the slasher is kicking up, the bird of prey is circling around and seeing what it can um, get for a free meal, obviously. Oh, okay. So further up, there's peacocks. And there was chickens, there was deer, and a lot of, uh, there's a fruit orchard up there. Did you take any photos of the peacocks? I took one or two photos of the peacocks. I've actually got one with the tail. Really Our? extended. Yeah. Yeah. What about the deer? The deer, they didn't have their tails no. extended. Oh, okay. <laughs> they were a bit flighty as well. Oh, were they? Uh, but oh. I've got one sitting down, a little, little toddler. Okay. And, All right. um, we'll just have to see how they turn out. Oh, look forward to I'll go around there tomorrow, have a look myself. Time for our afternoon snacks. The birds are all just coming into land at roost after being somewhere. We've got our binoculars handy, lots to see here. And now we're just going to have our Friday afternoon drinks. Cheers everyone. Cheers.
made a little mistake this morning rolling in our awning. Um, it was really, really windy and unfortunately we rolled it in backwards so it doesn't close properly. Uh, so this afternoon we're still waiting for the wind to drop down a bit more. We'll have to roll it out and hopefully we can rectify it. We'll let you know what happens. So we've rolled out the awning to its full extent and now it's rolling under. So I think Rich has worked out how to fix it. I'll get back to you. Oh, <laughs> that was nerve wracking, but it got in there. So now it's, it's in where it should be. It's in where it should be. Uh, we should be able to travel tomorrow. Yep. And look at the uh, sun on the sugar cane. Yeah, and the smoke. So what's cooking, Chef? <laughs> Kangaroo snags with camembert cheese and an assortment of grilled vegetables. Broccoli, carrot and zucchini. Sunrise here at Lake Redbrook. It's quite peaceful, except for the noise you can hear in the distance, which is a cane harvester up on the hill. They must be starting a cane harvest, obviously. It's almost 6 a.m. in the morning, they start early. We have woken to another beautiful sunrise. The sounds of the birds, the ducks, the honking of the geese, and a typical Australian scene, the harvesting of the sugar cane. <laughs> <laughs> 